Hello, I'm Dr. Marsha Bozak, and I would like to discuss ANA's new position statement, Ethical Considerations for Local and Global Volunteerism. The authors of this position statement have had many different experiences involving global volunteering. My first exposure to global volunteering was during my study service trimester when I was an undergraduate nursing student. In my current faculty role, I work with students as they consider study abroad or summer volunteer opportunities. Dr. Michelle Upfall's career is focused on global health. She has impacted nursing education programs nationally and internationally. She serves on the steering committee for nursing education for health volunteers overseas. Dr. Martha Turner directed the International Health Program at Uniform Services University of the Health Sciences. Currently, she is a consultant to a village clinic and volunteers in Japan and Vietnam. Nurses are often interested in volunteering and do so locally, nationally, and internationally. The purpose of this position statement is to promote ethically responsible volunteer efforts classified as short-term practice experiences in local and global healthcare and public health. The American Nurses Association believes that short-term volunteer activities are an appropriate response to disparities and inequities in healthcare across the globe. All nurse volunteer activities should be done in accordance with the Code of Ethics for Nurses and the International Council of Nurses Code of Ethics for Nurses. How should you approach your volunteer effort? Demonstrate social responsibility. Approach with cultural humility. Involve careful planning with the host community. Commit to sustainability. Five themes should be considered when designing a short-term volunteer experience. How volunteers will be recruited and prepared and supervised. The host community participation in defining the program and interactions with volunteers. The sustainability and continuity of the program. Respect for governance as well as legal and ethical standards. And finally, evaluation of the program's impact on the host community. Nurses and students benefit from local and global volunteer experiences. Volunteers often claim that the act of volunteering is a transformative event in their life. You as a volunteer may experience increased awareness of healthcare challenges, view professional practice from a different cultural perspective, and have expanded career opportunities and a foundation for future networking. Communities hosting volunteers may experience increased resources through donations and tourism, increased capacity to serve the community when short-term volunteer experiences become a bridge to ongoing sustainable volunteer programs, and finally, empowerment. Preparing for volunteer experience requires consideration of the potential physical demands, psychological fatigue, and exposure to safety issues and diseases not commonly found in the volunteer's home country. In addition, volunteers may experience cultural shock and reverse culture shock when returning home. Potential unintended consequences may occur to the host community from cultural differences and power differentials related to resources and lack of shared goal. Criticism of global volunteering includes perpetuating the idea of global poverty can be reduced through caring volunteers. Host communities may experience exploitation if the presence of volunteers divert resources away from community members. Harm to communities may also occur if services are not sustainable after volunteers leave. Evaluation of any short-term volunteer program should investigate the potential for unintended consequences to the host community. 
ANA recommends that all nurses champion volunteerism, whether by volunteering or by supporting and facilitating those who choose to volunteer. Take a moment to review these recommendations and reflect on ways you might enact these recommendations in the future. Consider this case study. Your nursing agency is sponsoring a short-term nursing volunteer trip. You are one of the participants, and the public relations director has asked you to create a daily blog with pictures to be disseminated to employees, administrators, patients, and financial supporters. What actions should you take to promote volunteer and host community confidentiality? What strategies will you need to implement to ensure that the photographs you post are culturally sensitive? Who are the key stakeholders from whom you will need to gain permission before you can start posting your blog? Should you share your blog with the host community? If yes, how? In addition to these listed questions, you might want to discuss how the nursing agency should evaluate the trips, outcomes, and sustainability. Thank you for taking the time to learn more about the ANA's position statement on the ethical considerations for local and global volunteerism. I hope this presentation has inspired you to consider how you might support and participate in short-term volunteer activities. To learn more, please refer to the position statement which is available on Nursing World.